Right, guys, we are good to go. I will see you in Tromsø. Tromsø. Wow. Private bus. Just 27. About 7 million kilos of snow. It's <laughs> gonna look like a murder scene. <laughs> Weather conditions. Unbelievable. This is a real Arctic circle. Is this the wind? This is wolves. Did I manage to see the northern lights or not? Let me reveal you the whole truth. What a day today! So guys, are you ready? We are going to Tromsø. It's time to hunt the northern lights. <laughs> take about an hour to get to the airport The airport is not too much different if you're curious how I was flying during pandemic you can watch my video my sweet sweet travel tradition soy cappuccino in Starbucks at pretty much every airport in the world where Starbucks exists Flight is on time. One o'clock to Tromsø. Information: The next model boarding charge for Vienna of Norwegian first Vienna boat tour. Welcome to Romzo, guys. Three main things to do here. Three. Three main things to do here. First, to see the northern lights. That's reason number one of me coming here. Second, spend the night in a nice hotel. Temperature will be minus five in the room and it's going to be a whole night like this. And three, I need to know how to pronounce Tromso correctly. Waiting for the bus, going to the hotel. from the window. Magnificent. Last time, the only time I've been here, it was July last year. Wow guys, the view is absolutely fantastic here. Wow, this is so Arctic. Clarion Hotel, Aurora. 
my previous hotel experience in Norway was quarantine hotel. If you didn't see that amazing 10 days of my life, you better watch my previous video. So, for two nights in Tromso, I'm staying in Clarion Collection Hotel. The location is absolutely great. It's very city center. What do we have for this price? We have breakfast and dinner included. They are, gym is open, no matter that the global situation is like this, but gym is open. Sauna and jacuzzi are open, but you need to book in advance and maximum three people. Okay. And the hotel is hoping that I will have a great stay. Let's see. I'm on my way to book hot tub. Breakfast. I didn't go, I slept it away. I will show it to you tomorrow. The hot tap is booked for one o'clock. It's going to be for one hour. If you like my channel, if you like my approach to life in Norway and also travel around Norway, subscribe to my channel. Hot tap, it is done. I'll show you the view. Oh my god, guys, look at this cool stuff. It's jacuzzi with a view. Consider coming to Tromsø, you will not be disappointed. If you like this one and would like to know more about living in Norway and also travel around Norway, don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Guys, and the floor here is heated. Oh my god, this is so cool. Warm floor with lots of snow around. <laughs> Two hours later. If you remember, dinner is included in the price for the ring. It's called complimentary dinner. The option for dinner, we have a pasta salad. Uh, looks like Greek salad to me. And couscous salad. Um, soup. plan for tonight is quite simple. I will get some proper rest. I guess tomorrow is going to be a very, very interesting day. Good night. Good morning, guys. I made it for breakfast today. I will show you what's for breakfast in Clarion. And also at 5.30 we are going to ice domes. And this night I'm staying in a nice hotel with a temperature minus 5 in my room. But coffee first. Guys, I'm becoming such a fan of Norwegian coffee. Love it. Typical Nordic salty addition for the breakfast. Mamelade yogurt. Good morning. Just a quick breakfast and let's go out for some fresh air. Two hours later. What's next on the menu? It is 4.30 p.m. in Tromsø. 
I almost fell. <laughs> this 4.30 p.m. in Tromsø. I'm meeting the guys in a magic ice bar in Tromsø. And at 5, I will meet the guys. At, uh, at 5 o'clock, we will go to ice domes. A little bit of the views of winter Tromsø. Oh my god, and this is the bus actually. This is the bus which will take us to the ice domes. Guys, it's going to be a private bus. Oh, this is the best way to show Tromsø from a warm and cozy bus. So, you can make yourself comfortable over here. We'll just be in here for a little while. So I work for the winter season, but I've never seen the midnight sun. Thank you so much, there thank you. you. You're welcome. Yes, my coffee. Coffee from a traditional Sami cup. This is the suit I'm going to be wearing outside. Just to remind you, it feels like minus 25. The minus glass. 27 even. Yes, yeah, so actually it's minus 13, but, but it feels like minus 27. This is exactly what you would expect from Arctic Circle, I would say. Exactly. An experience like this, that's a real Arctic experience. Let's go outside and experience this minus 27 Celsius. What a feeling, like, and this is how deep it goes. Wow, wow, so this is how snowshoeing looks like. And we're about to start the fire. Arctic salmon. Is this the wind? This is wolves. We have a wolf pack around here. Thank you so much, Mark. Oh my god. Wow. This is so tasty. Okay, thank you so much, Martin. Welcome. This is an ice dome. We're gonna start off in the bar. Right, so the ah, okay, we're starting with an ice bar. We're gonna have a little berry drink. Nice. Uh, we're gonna serve it in glasses that are made out of ice. Oh my goodness, yes. They're very cold and slippery. Woo! So it's important to have two fingers on the side. Right. And one on the bottom. Okay. Because if you let it drop with this color, uh -huh. it's gonna look like a murder scene. That's the Rovia. Nice. Ah, uh, is this uh, the same temperature in the room as here? Yeah. <laughs> okay. Wow. 
Oh my god, this is like proper work of art. It's a cat! Meow. If this is the room. Oh my god. Look at these walls. Wow. So basically guys, if you want to understand how cold it feels here, you can just put your hat in your fridge. That's going to be around the same temperature. And our next stop is ice cinema with a table. Cheers. And screen. And um, we use the big balloons. So we have a big metal frame on the floor and we have the balloon, um, which is the exact right shape for the dome. Because there's a few things, it needs to be strong, it needs to be easy to take out when you have all the snow on top. And it needs to be the perfect shape. Because the shape of the domes make it safe. We used about 7 million kilos of snow to make the ice domes this year. So guys, I survived a night in a nice hotel next dog sledding. So I will try for the first time in my life to do this activity. accident yes well done weather conditions unbelievable this is a real arctic circle today Final question now. Did I manage to see the Northern Lights or not? Did I manage to see this fantastic event, which was the main reason of my trip to the Arctic Circle, or I wasn't just lucky enough this time? Let me reveal you the whole truth, how it actually was. <laughs> so no rest. It's going to be the Northern Lights hunt for eight or nine hours. We started in a grape on the beach in a whole darkness. And this is how the Northern Light hunt starts mm -hmm. in a whole darkness. And of course, this is the setup. Yeah, sure. This guy is not mine, but I'm quite jealous. And this guy is mine. And that's how I look like. I have a flashlight on my head. At the beginning, it was only the dark sky. So I lost my hope. And then this started happening. No doubts, it was one of the best things I've ever seen in my life. Sometimes the only thing you need is just to believe in magic. And if you truly believe in it, it will happen. I promise. Thank you so much guys for sharing. <laughs> Thank you so much guys for sharing my trip to Tromso with me. If you like this video and want to see more travel around Norway, don't forget to subscribe to my channel. <laughs>